Police say the suspected serial bomber terrorizing Texas is dead. Authorities say the 23-year-old suspect blew himself up in his vehicle north of Austin overnight as a SWAT team closed in on him. CBS's Nikki Batiste has more. Police collected evidence Wednesday morning from the scene where the Austin bombing suspect blew himself up. Law enforcement sources have identified the bomber to CBS News as 23-year-old Mark Condit. Investigators say they had tracked him down to a red roof in north of Austin overnight. They were waiting for tactical teams to arrive, but when Condit left the hotel in an SUV, officers closed in on him. As members of the Austin Police Department SWAT team approached the vehicle, the suspect detonated a bomb inside the vehicle. Police say information they gathered over the last day or two led them to consider Condit a suspect. Surveillance teams were then able to locate the vehicle he was driving here in Round Rock, which led to the confrontation and explosion. Authorities say Condit is behind at least five explosions this month, four in Austin that killed two people and one at a FedEx facility near San Antonio earlier this week. CBS Austin affiliate KI obtained these surveillance photos. It's believed the suspect dropped off two suspicious packages at a South Austin FedEx office. And even though Condit is dead, he may have already planned other attacks, so the threat may not be over. Continue to be vigilant. Um, we are concerned that there still may be other devices out there. There was a heavy police presence in the Austin suburb of Pflugerville Wednesday where Condit lived. Neighbors are finding it hard to believe. Nicest families you'd want to have, nicest neighbors as you'd want to have. Investigators say at this point they do not have a motive and they don't know if he had any accomplices. Nikki Batiste, CBS News, Round Rock, Texas. One SWAT member did suffer minor injuries in that incident.